Well, our inspiration is the Safari Woman. We interpret the Safari Woman quite simple, it's kind of like a low braid, very messy, a lot of textures. We're doing uh, actually a braid that is under, uh, and then we're bringing all the hair back, and we're just gonna crisscross and blend it in with the braids. Well, I'm using the Moroccan Old Treatment, which is like number one product that has been in the market for a long time. Uh, but we're using a new product that is uh, the Root Boost, which is a product that we use in the root, but also we use it through the entire hair to create texture. And it's one of our first products that actually lifts the hair and plumps the hair quite a lot. People are going to be loving it. They wanted a little bit of this feeling of Atlantis with a soft floatiness and the, you know, the hint of water. It was all about deep set finger waves, lots of product, and we wanted to find a way to modernize it, make it kind of relevant and reader viewer friendly. And to that end, we started off with a base of blow drying with the Moroccan oil light as a base. Hair feels great, protected from the heat. And then we're actually using the brand new root boost, but we're using it almost like a mousse. So we're spraying it very lightly throughout the hair, and it just gives the hair a really nice, give texture using two different curling irons when you use a smaller curling iron it gives you a wave a natural ridge which looks like a Marcel wave we're using a little bit of the glimmer shine spray in the palms of our hands and putting it through the top area so it gets a little bit smooth shiny almost wet but then the contrasting texture at the back with a roll pinned into the braid is going to be soft and fluffy I suppose it's not really so much a style. We just wanted the girls to be more like aspirational women. There's a slight sophistication with the side par. He, he just wanted it to be very kind of still quite real. There's a little movement in the front, so there's that nod to the 40s. We're just um, blow drying the hair to give it lots of, lots of volume, but more to create a really beautiful, glossy texture. It's almost like the girls have had their hair done yesterday and come into the show and they kind of selected it. So there's a little sexiness to it without it being kind of too messy. We're using the Moroccan oil products. Uh, we're prepping the hair with a protect spray and then just really a uh, nice amount of the volume mousse you know like in a salon like you just they've gone in and had a really nice blow dry the products are perfect to create this hair you know it's all about quality control lots of shine like beautiful healthy hair so light and pretty and fresh. I don't think I've ever seen Christopher Bailey do such a pretty collection. The look for Blue Marine is we want to have a, a slight rock and roll element to the girls. This would be a little bit more done and then broken down. So going through with the rock and roll styling cream and prepping all the hair and blowing it out. So we're completely dry, lots of volume, and we're gonna go through with the curling iron and we're gonna set it in a really natural way. And then we're gonna brush it out, put some hairspray on it, and then give it a little shake and let the girls go. These girls are doing like six shows a day, they have extensions, they have all kinds of things going on. We want to make the hair look as expensive as possible, and with Moroccan oil, we're able to make the hair look that way. I'm walking to the Christophe Lefer show, summer. The look, it's a very simple, very natural. Um, the reference is a movie uh, Truffaut, it's a baiser volé in France. Christophe, he liked um, hair, it's uh, done, and the texture is uh, not too much uh, product, just um, oil. The woman, it's uh, intellectual, not sophisticated, but just uh, look very simple. <laughs>